I'm a sculptor from since birth, pretty much. From designing his own pair of glasses out of multiple plastic to whipping up a mean breakfast. I, I love to cook eggs and bacon and toast in the morning, French toast, eggs in a hole. It's safe to say Jared Smith is full of ideas, and now he'll have a roommate to share them with. I can show him what I know, he can show me what he knows. Yeah. And there's going to be a walking a trail walk that goes around. around. Smith is one of 11 adults selected to move into the Jericho Project, along with nine Southern Wesleyan students. We don't really know of anybody, any college that's doing it like we're doing it, where it's intentional integration with our students living with the friends. The Pickens County Board of Disabilities will train these students on how to interact and relate to adults with disabilities. We're hoping the students will mentor the individuals, take them to class with them, to ball games, to eat. Anything that the students do, the individuals will be able to have access to everything on campus. Executive Director Elaine Tina says this new facility will help residents become more independent and students more educated. In essence, we are tearing down walls in the community and making people see that they're just like you and I. The building should be completed by this summer. She hopes to have everyone moved in by the start of fall semester. Well, I absolutely look forward to it, and I'm liking what I'm seeing so far. Brenna McDavid, WYFF News 4 in Central.